Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Honda is set to update the Odyssey minivan for the 2025 model year. Introducing several styling changes, advanced technology, and a simplified trim level structure. Every trim level now boasts newly designed wheels with a flexible Odyssey Elite featuring a new machine finish 19 inch head. The vehicle's color fillet has also been refreshed with the addition of solar silver metallic and smoke blue pearl paint. Inside the 2025 Odyssey, drivers will find a standard 7-inch digital instrument cluster. The best model now features a larger 9-inch touchscreen and increase of 1-inch from previous models. The updated infotainment system is not only larger but also faster, thanks to a more powerful processor. Wireless Android Auto and Apple CarPlay connectivity are included, along with additional USB-C port in both the front and rear of the vehicles. Upgrading to the Touring or Elite Trim levels include a new rear seat entertainment system with a 12.80 inch screen, replacing the older 10.2 inch setup. This system also includes an HDMI port located inside the console, which features a storage area for a streaming device. However, there is a downside regarding pricing. The entry level 39,635 US dollar EX model has been discontinued, making the EXL the new best model at 43,315 US dollar, including destination and handling charges. The Sport model, now known as the Sport L, costs 44,465 US dollar. The Touring Trim level is priced at 48,005 US dollar, while the Elite Trim level top the rank at 52,275 US dollar. Under due, the engine remains unchanged with a naturally aspirated 3.5 liter V6 engine, producing 280 power and 262 pound feet of torque pair with a 10 speed automatic transmission. In Japan, Honda Avar and Odyssey imported from China with a hybrid powertrain based on a 2.0 liter 4 cylinder engine, delivering 212 horsepower. Delivering 212 horsepower and 232 pound feet of torque via a continuously variable transmission. 